So man, you know, growing up in South Bend uh, as a kid, Notre Dame is such a huge staple in our community. Like, and then I played basketball. So, you know, as a, a kid that played basketball and ultimately had an opportunity to play Division One basketball, a lot of my life was coming to Notre Dame uh, with my parents to the Notre Dame women's basketball games and even some of the men's games. My dad brought me to the Joyce when I was a kid to see Jordan play against, uh, I think it was like Sean Kemp. So like for me, Notre Dame has just always been a, a source of inspiration. In 2004, when the DeBarlow Performing Arts Center opened, we sought to be a place for community and a you know, community for all types of backgrounds um, and diverse communities, all that make up South Bend. So we went on a number of listening tours throughout the community with a number of influential black community leaders um, with underrepresented populations here on campus. Um, and while everyone talked about they're grateful that we're able to bring in national and international touring artists, the thread that sort of wove itself throughout those conversations was the lack of presenting local artists. Um, so that was something that we knew we could, we could really grasp onto and overcome. Um, and that is when we met Austin Gamage. There's a handful of events that I've been able to do over the years. A couple of the signature ones that a lot of people know are um, the gallery event at the South Bend Museum of Art. We also have the Orange Moon event that we've done at the Chicory Cafe. Um, I've partnered with a great team in the city of South Bend on the Vibes Music Festival. We just had our um, third annual event. Um, there's also the silent headphone events that I've done. Um, I've also do a rooftop event called The Sunset. So I've been able to do a handful of events. And I think the biggest thing uh, with these events, I've always tried to make sure that there was a space that was inclusive for people that were like me and look like me and come from the same background as me in the community. I think it's important that we always get access to some of these key spaces, whether it's downtown or Notre Dame or wherever it may be. And so I've had the opportunity to kind of travel around the U.S. and even out of the country and experience some really cool um, events or uh, locations. And I just try to make sure people that are in the community get to experience those as well.